five years. Can you believe it? Well, since Georgia played in the Rose Bowl, and that makes this game extra special for dogs who have relocated to the West Coast. Well, it may be across the country, but Southern California has a large contingent of Georgia fans. Good Days Claire Sims is live at the Rose Bowl this morning. And Claire, I understand that they have big plans for the game. Yeah, you know, West Coast Georgia supporters, they usually have to make big travel plans to be able to see the dogs play. But in just a few short days, Georgia, they're going to be suiting up here at the Rose Bowl, giving people who live here in SoCal and who celebrate the dogs extra reason to be excited about this game. Mark Del Rosario graduated from the University of Georgia and then followed up with UGA Law, and he has lived out in California for about 15 years now. He says he tries to make the cross-country trip to see at least one game a year, usually at homecoming. Now, he is very active in the UGA Alumni Association Southern California chapter. He used to be the president, and he says they have more than 3,500 members right here in L.A. and Orange County. They are all, of course, thrilled that the dogs are making the trip to them this time around. Del Rosario has tickets for the Rose Bowl on Monday, but he says with all the UGA fans coming here to California, the days leading up to the game are going to be just as fun. You never know what you got till it's gone, and to have all these Georgia people coming here, even from my own hometown in, in Little Vidalia, Georgia, um, it's, it's really cool to have home come to us. It, it's really heartwarming. All right, Del Rosario, he's got his tickets. His friends have their tickets. They plan on having a big tailgate with a lot of other UGA alumni before the game on Monday. And the one hard thing he says about living out here, of course, is all the smack talk from uh, UCLA and USC fans. But he says the really hard thing is those noon kickoffs back on the East Coast. Well, that's 9 a.m. here. So you have to Ooh. eat breakfast while you're watching the dogs play. That is not going to be the case on Monday. Uh, of course, the game kicking off around 5 o'clock Eastern. So it'll be 2 o'clock here, lunchtime instead of breakfast. We are <laughs>